Claudia, what would you recommend for anal gland health to the average owners who's having expressions done or believe they need them done? So this is a great question, common problem. Uh, we might've talked about anal glands last night, actually. And with anal glands, I'm always thinking about, is there food sensitivity, leaky gut? Is there a neurological issue? Because the anal glands, where they sit, they have very small openings. And if we have a food sensitivity that's creating inflammation in the GI tract, what can happen is, is those little openings that should be, you know, contracting on their own with a bowel movement, if they're closed off, that's when we start getting anal gland impactions. We can have um, anal gland abscesses, or that's where you need to go in and have them exposed expressed all the time because your pet's scooting, they're irritating, um, they're irritated. And so that would be NutriScan tests. Do they have food sensitivity? What's going on? Do they need a chiropractic adjustment? This is where chiropractic works really well. And then also if we're dealing with an imbalance in the body, I use a lot of Chinese herbal medicine for my patients. So looking at the constitution, looking at what food are we feeding? Are they on a kibble diet that we know is more warming? It comes with a lot of glyphosates. I uh, hope you listened to Dr. Katie Congas's um, webinar the other day, um, all about the GMOs versus organic versus like kibble foods versus grain free, very eye opening. And there's a lot of research that that shows that our kibble diets with dogs, they have a really high concentration of glyphosate in their body when they're being tested. So I'd, I'd look at all of those factors and look at why is that happening and how do we fix it? And then also you can check out our blog post. We have an entire blog post on natural remedies for dog anal glands at the naturalpetdoctor.com. Just click on our blog area and type in anal glands and it'll pop right up. Um, so definitely check that out because we did an entire video and there's additional resources to help guide you. But that's where I'd start. Chiropractic, NutriScan test, and making sure we're on a optimal species appropriate diet.